What's going on, guys? My name is Lane, also known as Shaq Alaka Lane. My name is Jack, also known as Sexy Potato, and this is episode 13 of Streamer yep, Stories, 13. where we talk about um, our progress in becoming streamers and content creators in general, as well as other things. And today, once again, we have a special guest, if you want to introduce yourself. Uh, hi, guys. I'm Emily. Um, you guys might know me as Dorkish Sorceress, and I stream... Let's see. Wednesdays and Thursday nights, I do a lot of horror game streaming. So I just started Drink for Your Life on Wednesday nights, which is my new horror game right after Bioscotch. <laughs> which, <laughs> um, and then, of course, Gin and Tails, which is my favorite night of the week on Thursday nights. We I think that's everyone's favorite horror. night of the week. Yeah. <laughs> I love yeah, yeah. It so much. Um, and yeah, that is Thursday nights. We read short stories and we drink gin. And that, by we, I mean another Garcia and I. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and uh, I've been streaming for like a couple months now and been loving every moment of it. <laughs> right. Uh, so Go. Let's, let's get started oh on the my questions, God, my I guess. camera just freaked out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Lane's camera forever flickering. It's only, we'll only in Discord. That. It's like only in Discord. I uninstalled drivers and whatnot. It's just, I don't know why. It's just weirdest it's, thing. Okay. Um, um, so how how and why did you get started streaming? Yeah, yeah, that's always the question. What started? How did it begin? Origin uh, story time. <laughs> no pressure. It's yeah. not like I have a dramatic one. Like I was raised from birth by wolves and like turned oh. into streaming. Oh, into streamer <laughs> streamer wolves. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> Yeah. Um, but no, so I think a lot of people that started streaming around this time have a very similar answer, which is like COVID happened, right? Um, okay. And, um, for me, leading up to COVID, I was a regular performer. I, I sing with a band. I also teach line dancing. So I had all these like creative outlets in my life. And then um, we had quarantine and everything shut down. And Oof. every all of that was like gone. Yeah, completely yeah. ripped out of my life. And so um i spent a couple months just like being really depressed and um then on a whim decided to try streaming uh it was really it was really just like i put zero i should have put more thought into it you know in <laughs> retrospect <laughs> but at the time garcia was going out of town for like a weekend that's that that was kind of my motivation because when garcia leaves and on top of like covid and stuff um I, I, I talk about mental health in my streams a lot, by the way, if you don't know. Um, I deal with a lot of depression. And when Garcia leaves, then I tend to like, I tend to go into the deepest recesses of myself. And it's not a good place for me. So then I was um, thinking about how to kind of give myself something to do that weekend. And I was like, what if I tried streaming on Twitch. And I, at the time I had like no idea what that meant. And, and the day of, I maybe spent like one hour looking up OBS and like how to set it up. Mm. And then I, I streamed. I think that's how everybody's first stream. Yeah. It's just like, what is OBS? <laughs> how yeah, stream Just do like a basic Twitch. picture, like just video or face game at the top or right or left and then just play whatever oh, yeah. game. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Also, uh, Spell Blooper, thank you for the uh, tier one sub. I don't have oh, my yeah, words yeah. activated. Random, but... okay. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Um, uh, yeah, so I, I definitely, like, like without any sort of forethought, I jumped into it, and I ended up loving it. It was just absolutely so much fun. Um, the first night, I think I had, like, my game capture set up in my face and that was it. Like I had yep. no idea what I was doing. No and alerts. No alerts, nothing. I think I had one person in chat and it, it wasn't, I didn't even tell anyone, you guys. Like Garcia didn't know. None of my friends knew. And I had one random person pop in and say hi. And it was like, oh, wow, there's actually someone watching. Like yeah. a fucking godsend. Um, but yeah, I think that uh, mostly the reason why leads uh, is down to COVID and, and just needing that outlet from my mental health to have something to focus on. Um, loving performance. I love performance of any kind. And I felt like this was a good platform for that. And then also just, you know, Garcia leaving. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Two days. Well, yeah, no, that's, uh, that's like, I, I feel mean, like very relatable in a lot that's of ways. Cause... Basically what happened with Jack and I, or Potato and I. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And I know my first few streams. Oh yeah. I told nobody. I was like, no. <laughs> Like, no, I'm not telling people what I'm doing. Heck no. Uh, and I, 
<laughs> talked about it. I, I've talked about it before. The hardest part was being like, hey, yeah, guys, I do this thing. I'm, now. Streaming. <laughs> I'm trying to do this. Yeah. yeah. Um, oh, but so. it's it makes such a difference when like you're actually somewhat successful with it. Yeah. Too. Telling like your real life friends. Is like you're like yeah, yeah when you're I can be like, hey, I've made a paycheck hey. or something. Like that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, it makes I, a I lot easier. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So and it seems like I, I'm Garcia. Obviously, is extremely supportive considering he's on it all the yeah. time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. and I see him in the chat. I see him stop on my stream the other mm -hmm. day and all that stuff. So it's really cool to um, yeah have that. He's wonderful. Um, and it and it is funny because at first he, I think he was uncertain about it. He's like he he. I told him he came back that weekend and I, or at the end of that weekend, and I told him, "Oh shit." Uh, Garcia, oh. here for those. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> get <it stopped. laughs> hey, uh, do we want to move this to my channel real quick? Do you care? To... <laughs> I mean, we can for next week. Uh, 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 yeah, Garcia. No, you're not supposed to do that during the other for this. Stop it. It's okay. Stop but uh, it, thank man. you. <laughs> Real MVP. Honestly, Garcia is the, like, he he has made this so much easier for me. Mm -hmm. and, like, the, so the, at first I told him about it, and I could tell he was, like, really confused and uncertain. Like, what, <laughs> what are you doing? Like, but I can't blame anybody for, no. any, like, because I would... I I could I could see that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and there's a lot of concerns I mean that that we don't always talk about in like being a person on the internet and like having all these personal things about you. Um and he's a he's a worrier so he he was worried yeah. of course. Um but over time like it it took maybe like a couple weeks of him watching streams and then he mm -hmm. he was starting to really get into it and then I had the idea of including him in Gin and Tails and it just like yeah. I think yeah. Yeah, it's given him purpose too. <laughs> what would he do without that voice? I, I know, mean, right? Oh, oh God, Gin and Tails would no be nowhere without Garcia. Like I can't read. I do it because someone else has to, right? But yeah. Him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. You want to take the next question, okay. Jack? All Tail. right, all right, all right. So, um, what what to, what question to pick? What question? Okay, okay. Um, so, what is something that was like the most difficult for you and like? Um, trying to do like streaming and growing and all that. Um, Cause I feel like there's all kinds of challenges that you run into that you don't even think about. Um, so I was wondering if anything stood out to you. Um, so I know that for, for everyone, it's the same too. Like we talked about when you start and you have like no one there, there's a lot of anxiety mm -hmm. too about, about talking about talking to people, you know, and sharing the fact that you're a streamer. Um, yeah. But, uh, but, uh, so I think the very initial, like, few times when you're streaming, trying to talk to yourself because you've got no one in chat, yeah, like <laughs> trying to fake your way through it, that's very difficult. Fake it till you make it, right? Yeah, <laughs> definitely, definitely. Yeah, yeah, nobody wants to watch a, a silent stream, no, no. yeah, exactly. Um, I've, I've seen streams like that. And I think doing like the YouTube stuff has probably helped us like be able to talk with no one in the chat too. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you have to pretend that there's an audience there because hypothetically there will be eventually. Yeah. Um, yeah so I think it's so. like, you know, like making just gameplay YouTube videos and then streaming for no one is basically the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. And, um, I think the only benefit you get, obviously you get with the um, videos, you get the benefit of like, wow, that sucked to delete. Yeah, <laughs> um, <laughs> nobody ever sees it, yeah. um, which also can be a bad thing because then you like you never release something. So, mm -hmm. um, but you can plan it a bit better. At least I feel like. Um, mm -hmm. But yeah, no, I agree. They are similar. Yeah, um, and then just like um, even now, trying to talk to people who I'm not sure will understand about streaming and like trying to yeah. yeah. Like, I have supportive people in my life, like Spell Blooper and Garcia are here. Like they are, they are Kojak is actually in the other room. <laughs> so like, okay, hey. oh, yeah. but uh, but Kojak, at the same feel free to open that door and say hi. <laughs> yeah, walk in, <laughs> walk da, in. Da, da, da. extra interview. Guys, <laughs> 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 we were hiding Kojak the whole time. Uh, he actually joked about popping in and like he has a his whole motorcycle get up right now. So like coming okay. in in the helmet and then like uh -huh. dancing. For you guys <laughs> i mean should have done it should have yeah. done it because I, I, I figured i should prevent you guys from 
<laughs> from having to be subjected to it. You're gonna, you're gonna prevent A1 content? Come on. <laughs> oh, you're right. I should I should have thought more. I should have thought more. What yeah. makes you think this is like a serious interview? Oh my oh. god, it's real that life. Kojak, get the fuck in here. <laughs> <laughs> but uh <laughs> Um, so, so, and I, I deal with a lot of social anxiety in my mm. like, life, which, which seems weird because I'm literally talking to people now for Twitch all the time, but there's definitely a difference, um, between yeah, no. on Twitch and like talking to people directly yeah. for me, for my anxieties. And, uh, so like trying to, to be bold enough to tell people like, this is something I'm doing and it's actually really cool. And like you said, um, it's easier once you have a little bit of like back when you're not just having one viewer but you have a mm -hmm. few people watching it yeah, yeah people actually talking in the chat help a little helps a lot <laughs> yeah we've i think um I, about I also get oh go ahead so many we've talked about that so many times like having actually people like to talk you like even like not even throw out the entire stream but just like for like an hour or so like it's like it's completely different it's it can help you switch in that mindset at least even yeah um, yeah I agree exactly completely. Yeah, and I, I think uh, as far as like telling people like in real life, I was I'm kind of lucky in that like all my friends are like I'm obviously much younger than a lot of people here, so like all my, all my friends know all about streaming. Um, yeah. Half of them have already tried, but none of them were like successful, right? Because I feel like so many yeah. people do get to that point where it's like no viewers. They do that for like a day, and they're like, "Wow, that sucked," and they give up. Yeah. Um, so. When I'm like, oh yeah, I do this, and they're like, oh wow, that's cool. And then I talk about, the I actually, you know, I like, I don't average a ton, but you know, if I get average like five to seven people a stream, they're like, wow, yeah. that's crazy, that's insane, that's so many people. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So, it's a, uh, it's really cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think yeah. breaking that initial wall too, like the the hardest part is breaking that wall of like the one viewer or two viewers every time, you know, yeah. once you've gotten to a point where you have like- That affiliate barrier. That's yeah. really it what it is, yeah, yeah, yeah. right? It makes such a huge difference. It really does. Um, oh. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. Uh, yeah. Let's see, other challenges. I was thinking about the fact that, like this sounds really silly, um, but like as community has grown, and the community is amazing. That's not a challenge. Oh, yeah. I, no. It's <laughs> such a cool community that's come about. It seems like it was so quick. It um, was, yeah. Because, <laughs> like, I, I rated Breeze. I don't know how long, like, all you guys had been associated before that. Um, it's actually family. Yeah, they're literally Oh, is family. he family? I didn't yeah, know yeah. that. Yeah, they're literally family. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> so, I, you know, I just raid Breeze. I find him. And um, I rate Turbo, find him, rate Izzy, and suddenly there's like all these people. I'm like, what yeah, happened? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> there's, like, there's like 30 people now. You I can't keep track of them all. Was, we like, were signing up for a whole community. I oh, know. yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> the one thing with the community, though, is like that I'm finding is like we're now we're kind of like all competing for viewers. Is kind of that like does the, become like a the, thing sometimes. The point that we're getting to. That's what I that's exactly what I was gonna say was like the unexpected challenge I'm facing now, like the biggest thing it, hurdle we're trying to figure out and work around is just like one supporting everyone. Like yeah. how do you yeah. do that? It's, it's, it's just hard. so hard. Yeah, you've got like 15 people on uh, some day there have been times when I'll have 15 tabs on my computer. Oh yeah. And I'm trying, I'll cycle between them and like try to oh. talk to everyone, but I just you just can't. Um and it's really stressful. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, so, well, I mean, so, that's part of the reason I wanted to start streaming at a different time is because everybody yeah. streams in this afternoon to mm -hmm. night time slot, and I'm like, I might do better if I'm sleep stream in the middle of the day because yeah. nobody's streaming. I mean, look at um, him, like, and there's all these people, right? For example, like I think Cabana Caveman is really the only person, uh, sometimes Ray streaming during the day, and they're yeah. like, they're like always like pretty much everyone in the community is like just in their chats like that entire yeah. time, so. It's definitely a market that's worth uh, exploring, I think. Yeah, and yeah. We I think we've, yeah. Jack and I have talked about like what we kind of want to do. We're either going to, you know, both switch our schedules to what, like 1 p.m. Central or like I'm he's going to stream and I'm going to stream right after him basically every day. Mm -hmm. Probably yeah. be the other thing. Yeah, just but, like continue the trend, just pass it on. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, would be an interesting thing. Um, but so you said like, you know, you have like 15 tabs open. Something I found out about is if you have like a, the uh, Twitch um, player muted, you don't actually count as a viewer in that person's chat. I do know that, yeah. Um, yeah what I, I just... do is I, I, I turn it down really low on every single yeah. one except for one person, and then I'll adjust each time to like a new person. 
Yeah. yeah. I, uh, ridiculous. I found that out, and, like, I'm actually stealing this idea from Caveman Cabana. I'm, like, I'm going to have, like, a bot that, like, you know, pops up, like, every, I don't know, like, 15, 20 minutes. So I was like, hey, by the way, if you mute the player, it doesn't count as a, a follow That's or viewer. You yeah. Know, mute the tab or turn it down really low. Yeah. Yeah, it's a, like that something. A good choice. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, sorry, kind of went off on a tangent there. Oh, that's fine. That's the point of these, right? We're always <laughs> tangents are the point. We get a starting question and then you end up three miles. <laughs> that's the point. Um, it's a journey, not there's no destination. Here. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Um, yeah. But uh, I think there, there was one more thing I wanted to say about like like the community and, and kind of what we're thinking and maybe can help with you guys too is uh, Garcia and I were discussing the fact that like we can use raids as a tool to maybe explore new communities now. So we're, we're trying to find a way to make it fair and balanced. And that's also another like challenge is how do you make it fair and balanced? Like I want to raid the people that I love, but at the same time, showing that raid to someone new opens us up to a new community. And the larger yeah. this community gets, the well, more yeah. through yeah. different people. Um, well, I mean, like, that's um, that's how I ended up finding Turbo. And, and, uh, and well, yeah, Breeze, yeah. I found Turbo and Izzy because I was like, huh. Because, you know, it was one day I was like, hmm, do I raid, like, Breeze again? And I was like, ah, oh, I'll go find somebody else. And then running into Turbo. And another time I ran up running to Izzy. And I feel like they're big staples in the community now that would have never we never would have found them right yeah. had i not just yeah. randomly stumbled upon them um, <laughs> um and then there's like, also the balance of though like how many can i handle <laughs> yeah <laughs> like, uh, it's how, a lot how, right how now many, so i've been like, chilling I mean, right like, now i've like never been like followed to so many people and had like so many people oh, yeah. online at once yeah i'm used that, to having like, like five yeah channels i follow you know, yeah, I used like, to be, you know your normie twitch streamer watching like the big streamers and that's all you do yeah um and then i was just like oh oh this is fun follow 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 <laughs> yeah. follow yeah. follow and now it's like i have to hit show more 13 times to get to the bottom. Know, right <laughs> you, have to show, you have to press show more just to see all the people online it is just like oh, something gosh. i never would have thought would happen <laughs> yeah <laughs> you're, not wrong. you're not wrong yeah i just think like you know the more that we diversify um that means that like maybe it doesn't have to be me then like you know there's someone else who's going to be in that stream and like i can be on some and and try to like meet see everyone at least once a week you know but then the bigger yeah. it is the more you have yeah. people hopping around yeah and, um, and it, it's so, hard because you have to find a balance because if like <laughs> sorry lane but um no, if there's okay. like because i feel like i'm already at the point where it's like big enough where i'm like there's people in the community i don't know like i yeah i like some days i'll just be like i'll be like oh yeah Who's you that? Cut oh, you, you cut out there. Oh, did I? Yeah. Sorry. But it's like, sometimes I'll like be talking to somebody, somebody will hop in the Discord or something and be like, oh, hey, what's up? It's this dude. I'm like, who is this? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> Never met them. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And it's just like, there's so many people. It is true. Um, yeah, you're not wrong. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, um, it's hard because it's like, I want more people, but then it's like, I don't feel like I can hold that many connections. And yeah. it's just going to kind of like fall um, apart eventually. And I... It's one thing difficult. that like I kind of talked about this last podcast, but I want to do is like actually go find people that stream like you know during the day before all of us stream and try and get them into the community because I think that would really benefit everyone honestly. Because then you it take would take their like, people, yes, and then they raid us because exactly. we're after them. Big yeah. Brain. <laughs> um, because <laughs> you know, because like those like viewers, like you know, bringing people from that time period like we're not gonna be competing with them you know and then yeah. uh it'll yeah. be more people for us to go view during the day but like i think that's kind of like because like I, I don't like it's i do want to go raid new people but i don't want to be like you know bringing more people in to compete with at the same time yeah it's yeah. i don't know it's a weird balance that that's going on right now yeah I agree. I, I've definitely felt that. That I've we decided that the way we were going to tackle it, at least raiding was um we're gonna do three different types of raid and just like do them in the same order every time. So mm -hmm. it'll be like someone from the community, um, someone who is a little bit bigger, and then someone who's got like brand new, like never not okay. maybe not even affiliate yet. Um, but to me it's just more like I see the benefit in in expanding the community and I think that that while it's stressful 
the bigger it is, the less we have to put the pressure on each person. To yeah. yeah. Mm. No, I can see but, that. Yeah. But I've started doing recently for my raids is I'm like, all right, I go to my list. I'm like, all right, who has the least uh, viewers right now? All right, you're, I'm raiding. That's a common one too. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And I love that. I, I try to do the same thing as well, at least frequently, but it's, it's yeah. also a balancing act because then you're, you're thinking about, well, you got to raid people that are also going to impact your growth. And like, it's mm -hmm. a very, yeah, for sure. Thing. Yeah. <laughs> you want to support the people who are maybe not doing as well as you, but you need support yourself. Kind yeah, of. yeah. We're, we're, none of us are making enough right now that this is like a full time job no. or anything like that. Like, this is no. just like. It's fun, though. Yeah. It's, oh, it's so much fun. It's definitely stuff. But like, obviously, the goal, you want to grow it more and more. So, um, balancing the needs of others as well as yeah. like yourself, right? Like, um, you don't want to underestimate the fact that you do want to grow yourself. Yeah. Um, so um, I, I can definitely see that. I feel like we kind of talked about that third question. Yeah, our third question was <laughs> what helped you the most in growing, and we just talked about <laughs> we just that. So, so I'm just going to skip that one. The community. The yes. community. <laughs> there you go. Always the community. Get involved. Well, it, it, and I guess just one more thing to add is like I I try to stress it to people who are wondering why they're not succeeding but mm -hmm. some people just don't get it it's it's really yeah, about because like you find the community they don't realize like the time you have to spend outside of streaming you know networking essentially yeah that's which like, i know i've struggled a lot with lately. i mean because you know, if you decide not to go with a youtube route which a lot of people are like that's really the only way to grow on twitch it's going out going finding other people making a community and yeah, because Twitch is yeah. terrible on its own for growing. Oh, it's it is so bad. Yeah, yeah, it it's impossible it to grow on there um, when you're small. Um, so you have to do something like that. Mm -hmm. um, I still search for the name of people like that. I search for all the time just because I don't want to find them in the list. You oh know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and it's still I have to type in their entire name even though. Like the the algorithm just does not favor. Yeah, it's like, it's like so um, weird that like you'll follow someone, but you're like you'll start to type in their name, and you have to type in the full name just to find them because yeah, it's like <laughs> it doesn't think that you're trying to find someone that you're you already yes. uh, follow. It's no, you've so watched weird. before. It's like oh, who's got like slightly more views, slightly more. Well, it's, that's know? not even that. Like I've literally like typed in Breeze Holic, and like the first until I like get to like a Holic part, like it's just people who like have like. And followers, I'm like, who are you? Yeah. Why are you coming out before Breeze? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Show me Breeze, please. <laughs> yeah. Show me the Breeze. <laughs> the only one that matters. <laughs> <laughs> I I was wondering if I could ask uh, or answer the question that Charles Bucco said really quickly. Okay. Uh, uh, sure. I didn't see it. He he just asked if Garcia Garcia is as dreary as everyone says he is. Culture down. <laughs> Down. I knew it was going to be I that. I just wanted Charles Bucco to know that Garcia is the dreariest person. Yes. <laughs> we only watch horror movies. Like, at, that's all we watch is horror stuff. I gotta do it. I'm fancy. <laughs> um, Are you? <laughs> oh, yeah. No, I'm good. I'll pass. Yeah. <laughs> um, Try playing a VR horror game the other day. Oh. Oh, did oh, you? Oh. I could imagine how stressful that would be in VR. Oh, it was, it was horrible. Um, I know I've there. seen Chicken play a couple of VR horror games on stream, and he looked like I feel like he's not really one that gets scared, but he definitely jumped at some stuff, <laughs> which I thought was funny. Yeah, it's something. It's something else. It's something else. Um, but anyways, before we get too far down this <laughs> random tangent, uh, let's go ahead. Uh, so. Um, we kind of talked about it a little bit, but um, what are your goals for like your Twitch um, or content creation on other sites, um, YouTube or anything like that, if you're doing anything on there? Yeah. So um, for YouTube, I, I actually like I started at first with YouTube um, and then I decided that the I'm I'm such a perfectionist and like the amount of effort and time I put into a video wasn't working. Yeah. Out right now. So um, I, I would love to get to the point where someday I could hire an editor, but like- That's the dream. Right. That's it's the always dream. the dream. <laughs> right? Yeah. We, Jack and I like, uh, said like, you know, if we're ever making any money off of YouTube, 
all of it's just going to go towards an editor. Like, like I, don't care, I don't care if we make zero If it's enough to YouTube. pay an editor, we're paying an editor. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah, the amount of time. I mean, just, I know you guys spend, because I see, like, Lane in chat all the time, and it's always like, hey, I'm here, but I'm working on another I'm video. editing this. I'm editing to- <laughs> yeah, it's, I was like, work, but editing, sorry. I mean, it's definitely going to calm down now that we're not doing The Last of Us anymore. Now that that's Yeah, finished. and I'm going to have... I think I'm gonna have more time because I'm not working like 35 hours a week, yeah, and um, all of that trying to do this as well. So, and also um, we are not, instead we are, of just in nursing school. Come on, that's easy. <laughs> we are completely changing what we're doing with WSD now. Like we've come up with an idea. Oh yeah, that's true. Um, we're doing a whole overhaul of the whole thing. Overhaul. Um, should, should we should we share what we're gonna go ahead? Go for it. Shoot um, it. Shoot it, there's 12 people here. Tell all 12 people. So essentially, uh, we're gonna turn, okay, so we already have like a WSD Twitch, and we're gonna turn it into like a, like a live game show with other streamers on. Yeah. Ooh, that sounds yeah. fun, dude. Yeah, so like yeah. Jeopardy. Yeah, so our first one- Twitch our first Jeopardy. Is, we're doing like Twitch Jeopardy. Um, <laughs> so, you know, like, and like, I'm like, like, I'm gonna go hard in this. Like, we're gonna have like all the animations that they have in the actual Jeopardy. Oh, yeah. Um, like I'm still trying to figure out how we're going to do the, you know, like who type hits the buzzer first. That's still like something I'm going to have to like figure out with programming or something. But like, I'm like super excited for it because <laughs> it's like, um, I don't know. It's just like, it's like something different, I guess. I mean, I guess I haven't really done all that much research. Yeah, I, I mean, like I've seen it before, but it's not something you see a lot of. For yeah. sure, and I think, and I don't think anyone does um, it live either. Like, I think it's mostly just YouTube videos. So I think that's I can think of be... one person that I've seen can do you? it live before. Um, okay. I don't know if anybody knows who Ludwig is, but I saw him do it. Okay, no. I've never heard of him. So he's, so. he's a zero point zero zero one percent streamer. Okay. That okay, and he's done it like twice yeah. ever. <laughs> so okay, but yeah, like, <laughs> and then we were joking how like uh, you know let's do Wheel of Fortune. Jack's gonna put like a giant oh, yeah. green screen in his room. Green and screen, be- and I'm like the the pretty girl. Right? Pointing yeah. at the signs, <laughs> and I'm just like, yes. uh, <laughs> but it's it's like a whole thing that we're like figuring out, like how we can do it live and like do it good. But uh, I think it's like it's gonna be like an exciting like change for WSD Express. That yeah, I think it's gonna be like more like yeah, it's gonna be more shareable content. You know, yeah, because we talked play. about like. There are so many let's plays and game videos out mm-hmm. there that like. Honestly, if you're not already super well established, nobody cares. Yeah. Like they just don't. Like and I like I wouldn't care if I saw our videos randomly. No. Like I totally get it. Like no. No. Um, Especially like even like with the entertaining fa- like uh, level that we're at, like we're not entertaining yeah. enough to really. Um yeah, and then so. also another thing like for, you know, so say we just go into some random streamer's stream and like, "Hey, we do this game show. Would you like to come on?" And then we're also like we're. And like, then there's gonna, prizes. Yeah, yeah, we're actually we have prizes. We have prizes like uh, like the first initial ones. Uh, just to see how it goes, we're gonna be like, all right, winner gets five gifted subs for their stream. Yeah. Um. That's fun. I love that. Yeah. I love that. Winner Great comes idea. back next week. Yeah. And it's just exactly. like it's it's a lot of work initially, but like you know after we have like in the initial like all the uh. You get the rhythm going. Yeah, we get the rhythm going. Audience, like because yeah. like we all have all like the animations and the keybinds for like everything is set up. Like it's just okay. Now we just have to change the questions and change the names of the players and stuff, and that's it. So. Yeah. But, yeah. It'll it'll probably have a couple hiccups at first, but that's yeah. normal. That's that, that's yeah, this whole so, thing has been just hiccups. Yeah. You're looking for the little bits that aren't. <laughs> it's, uh, so that's essentially what WSD Express is going to be become a game show. Yeah, yeah, and I think that um that almost fits the title better. I feel like um, <laughs> I feel like game showy kind of. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Yeah, yeah I think cool. it's cool. Um, and then, uh, we were talking about ourselves. We're supposed to be talking about yeah, you. Yeah, sorry, what, sorry. What are we doing? How did the, how did we end up? <laughs> <laughs> it's your job to be interviewed. Um, Not interview was. So goals. Goals. Right? goals. You want an editor. Keep going. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Goals. Goals. Oh, okay. Uh, goals. Uh, beyond that. So that that's kind of more just like if that ever comes about, that would be cool. Not really. Yeah. No, of course. Um, for YouTube, I, I would love to be able to be more involved in that market. But I just, for my own sanity, don't think I can spend 
eight hours a day. <laughs> like uh, YouTube <laughs> is definitely a grind that. Yeah. And we're lucky that we can split yeah. the load kind of, I mean, like I know Lane does a lot more than me. Uh, I just, to be honest, he does. <laughs> He's done a lot more than I have. Um, and I know part of that's, I just have, I just have a no, lot less. And time I understand that. I, have I mean, eventually when this COVID thing stops or, you know, we're not out lockdown, I'm probably going to be working more. Like you're probably yeah. going to have to start taking more of a load than I can. Yeah. I mean, I'm hoping I can once school starts and stuff, my things relax a little bit. Hopefully well, we'll see. We'll find out. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. It's a whole lot of unknowns in the future here. Yeah. Um, yeah. With COVID especially, I was thinking about that too, is like, we don't know, like when everybody starts returning to work and everything mm-hmm. goes back to normal, like how's that going to affect streaming? And that's something to think about too. Like, yeah. Um, um, but, uh, yeah, other goals I was, I was thinking about. So like for me, my entire life has been based around this idea of, um, doing what you love. Like, like that's all I've ever wanted to do is do what yeah. I love and be successful at it enough that I can make, uh, not like a, like, I don't need a lavish lifestyle, but just like a comfortable living. Yeah, um, yeah for sure. So I, I kind of like through music, through light, well, I thought line dancing for a time might fill that void, but it, it didn't. Um, and in the end, I've always been like, music has always been my main thing. Ultimately, mm-hmm. I've always wanted music to be what my, what comes about in my life. Um, but uh, yeah, so, f- so once I started, I've, I've started making like money through music before all of this happened and it was good. Um, yeah. And I, I guess it sounds kind of like, you know, selfish to talk about it in like a frugal way, but Ultimately, I think my goal for Twitch would be like, could I, could I combine this with music and have both of those things bring in enough, like it doesn't enough income that eventually I could like quit my job and just be doing the thing I really Yeah, enough. no, that would be no, super no. cool. Um, yeah. I don't think it's bad at all. That's a fantastic goal. Yeah. Um, I know it's, it's, um, it's like one of those things where it's like, it's kind of like off in the future for sure. Yeah. Um, I feel like, um, I know, I, I feel like you've definitely done better uh than like me and lane specifically have been doing yeah. uh because your chat's always you always have lots of people uh, you, <laughs> yeah. i see you up in the like 20s all the time yeah uh, which is super cool to see it um is, is it's a good show i love gin and tails <laughs> yeah i yeah, mean yeah, yeah, yeah exactly well you you got something that goes really so that's fantastic yeah i mean it's um, like you know for the podcast like the podcast usually like when i stream or like since we've started streaming it, they've been doing better than the rest of my streams. Oh so yeah, I, I mean, there's 12 people here right now. With yeah, I think my it's streams like, average like five right now. <laughs> you know, maybe we should just not stream gameplay and just just stream. Yeah, us we talking. should sit around and talk about streaming. <laughs> 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 Obviously, it's what we're good at. Yeah, people love uh, talking. That's that's why you have Twitch, right? I mean, yeah, they come to Twitch for the conversation. Yeah, yeah. at least for the small channels. Yeah. Oh yeah, for sure. Well, for the big I mean, like, like, if you go like watch Shroud right now when he had like five hundred thousand viewers, there's, yeah, good there's... luck. <laughs> oh my god, that was yeah. Like it's subscriber thing. only, and it's still. <laughs> yeah, it's insane. Uh... Did you see? He had, he had like a hundred sixty-one thousand subs his first stream back. Jesus. Yeah. Jesus. That's, it was that. insane. That's just like, oh yeah, let me stream for six hours and make a quarter million. Yeah, I think it was like it was just... over two million, <laughs> like diff, um, uh. Like at like different people. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Views. Um, views. Um, <laughs> Jeez, that's so many. That's so yeah. Many. It was ridiculous. Um, but yeah, good luck talking in that chat. Anyways, let's that's let's continue luck. with the interview. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So okay, for the next question, we had like, uh, are you planning to do anything with YouTube? Because you know, when we checked it out, you only got the two videos. Um, yeah, yeah. Or but just, I think um, you said that you you're started, but not really something that you're looking to do because um it's you know, a lot it, of it's a like lot of it just it is a lot of work it's a lot of time it yeah. really is and um i know like me and lane feel like it's a lot and i feel like i spend more time on the youtube than anything and the twitch is more successful right now yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. um by I, far yeah for sure i will say the one thing i do do and it's such a small thing that i enjoy is i post a new playlist every week on youtube so okay When I first started streaming, I was streaming, of course, with like copyrighted material music playing because I I didn't think I'd be successful. So I was like, I don't care if I get Mm -hmm. muted, whatever. Yeah, yeah, exactly. (laughs) And then, uh, and then I, as they really started cracking down on it, and as I got affiliate, I was like, oh, 
okay, <laughs> maybe I need to uh, stop playing this copyrighted yeah. music. Um, so then I came up with the idea of like every week I'll post a new or every other week at this point, I'll post a new playlist with new songs so that people can like listen along to songs that I would be playing and, and enjoy the same music as I do. So that's well, like the small cool. thing I do. Um, <laughs> that's, I mean, about, that's cool. Yeah. Yeah. Have you thought about doing uh, Harris Heller's like stream beat stuff? Yeah. So actually, so one thing I do play classic crime music on my on my stream because I have gotten permission from them to play. Oh, OK. Um, oh, so I do nice. have them. Yeah, I do have them playing most for like my intro and my be right back when I do those. Um, but I am also working. Mick Kojak and I, I think, are going to actually work on pretzel rocks because he has a subscription okay. on that. Like, so, but I know Harris Heller has a yeah. lot of amazing music yeah, that's basically too. what we've been using yeah. and like i feel like that's i always got it. we, we, we kind of got like started streaming at like the right time because it's basically right when he dropped that and it's like yeah okay, well now you don't have to worry about you know copyright music i just play yeah a lot this. of new tools came out uh during this whole like quarantine thing i feel yeah. like um mm -hmm. so true. it's a pretty good time to try streaming yeah <laughs> honestly and that's why so many people have it mm -hmm. well, no, a lot so, of people have a lot of free time too <laughs> yeah um so i mean yeah so we talked about youtube um and you're doing that is there any other things you you plan on doing because i know there's like there's so many platforms out there yeah. you know you got instagram twitter TikTok, all that kind of stuff <laughs> if TikTok's yeah. still around i don't know <laughs> that thing's <laughs> under fire or whatever yeah. uh, <laughs> <laughs> i think um well and I, I think too down the line like youtube might also become a, a platform more for music for me too like that might become a place where I can share videos of me like performing rather than yeah. video game content. That would actually um, yeah. probably be, that'd be great. That's, it would do a lot better than video game, just playing video games. <laughs> I'll tell you right now. Be a lot for sure, easier. For sure. like, yeah. Oh yeah. Intro, outro and uh, well, adjust some things maybe. <laughs> yeah, basically audio is all you'd have to really worry about. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Um, but uh, I do have an Instagram actually, like the very first thing I did after I decided to start streaming was I created an Instagram account for my, for my stream. And then like, I, I Garcia can attest to the fact that like for the first month, I spent so much time on Instagram and Twitch, like between the two, just like trying to market myself. And that's how I actually found the community was through like through Instagram. So mm -hmm. um, I, I do a lot with Instagram um and then i finally got a twitter but i i can't always think of things to say so <laughs> i post yeah. some that yeah i'm like, like, trying I to like on tw like i talked on this last podcast again but like i'm like i'm trying to do like one tweet a day at least and yeah. it's hard like even like for like a week it's been it's like oh, what do i say now All right <laughs> um, oh my dog uh, sent this picture of my dog i took like two months ago <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah I mean. and i know i got a <laughs> I probably should be doing that, and I haven't posted a yeah. single thing on my Twitter I mean, ever. I, I, I don't like, use Twitter. Actually, I did get my uh, my first new follower. I'm pretty sure from Twitter, because like mm -hmm. I posted something about me playing the piano on Twitch, and then like 20 minutes after that post, I got a new follower. I'm like, okay, sweet, Ooh. it's working. <laughs> Progress. It's, it's working. <laughs> <laughs> that's so exciting That's yeah the goal I, I actually think social media is a really good tool to use um for streaming because not only do you like connect with like new people but it gives you this chance to connect with the community a bit more and it also mm -hmm. kind of i mean from a marketing standpoint and i i studied business so i'm like i, I yeah, do no, think I, I did too um, but from a marketing standpoint, it, it just kind of refreshes in your brain, in their brain, the fact that you exist whenever they come across. Exactly. Your, like, yeah. Um, and so what I, what I started doing is for a lot of like new people that I meet through the community, I follow them on Twitch, we chat and chat or whatever. And then I follow them on Instagram if they have it. And it's just kind of this extra layer of like connection. Yeah. <laughs> um, but, no other plans right now beyond okay. that, I think. <laughs> I mean, uh, and that, that already is like a big handful alone. Like, <laughs> um, we've talked about this so many times before, but people really underestimate how much work this could be. Yeah, um, especially if you're doing multiple uh, social medias. Like, if you're doing them all, it's just... Yeah. Like, especially you throw YouTube in the mix. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I oh. do you guys, man, for sure. It's like... <laughs> Yeah, I like because I mean, just right now for work, I probably like, I'm lucky enough to keep my job. I'm on salary, so and then my hours just got reduced. So I'm like working like ten hours a week, 
So yeah, I have, you know, I, 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 have I have the time to be able to spend 40 <laughs> hours a week working on all the there's different social medias right now. So yeah, <laughs> it's a good time for Lane to. Yeah, to it's a good time for me for to get sure. into this. Um, but you know that's the thing. Like you know, because I have the time, I want to take advantage of it. I want to try and grow as much as I can because you know, um, I don't know, like probably half a year. Probably will have to be going back to work and working close to the 34 hour, 40 hours a week. Yeah. And uh, like, so like, I need to take advantage of it right now. Cause I mean, if like, yeah, so that when you get there, you could just be like, actually, no, I'm doing actually, streaming full time. Goodbye. Yeah, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> or hire an editor, maybe by that yeah, point. Hire, oh, yeah. yeah hiring working. an editor would probably reduce the hours a yeah. lot. <laughs> We'll just see what happens. That's kind of the whole yeah. game right now. It's just like yeah, it's where, where let's see where it goes. Um, <laughs> yeah, nice. so I guess um, we want we, probably, we talked a little bit about it earlier, but uh, we just want to talk about obviously what uh, you like the most about your channel. What what I feel like is most successful uh, your your gen and tails. Uh, genitals, whatever genitals. you want to call it. Uh, <laughs> no, I didn't know about genitals, okay? Somebody you didn't know about them? No, no. How, I, how did you I, not I, aware of these things? Did you not have health oh, in yeah, guys, educate me right now. All right, this I'm is sorry, you. I just made everyone uncomfortable. Uh, I'm, out of here. I'm just going uh, <laughs> to... Gonna, oh my gosh dip. slowly back away yeah this is what i do at parties too see this is why i stream and 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 uh and don't actually talk to people in person because yeah <laughs> that's a pretty normal reaction <laughs> oh, <I'm bored. laughs> oh my gosh um, um so <laughs> like what like how did you kind of come up with the idea yeah of how, origin, and tales? <laughs> origin um, story part two. Oh, uh, <laughs> you know i'm just a person that has a lot of ideas that's that's okay. honestly it is like I I'm I honestly what happens is I have like reverse insomnia. I wake up in the morning like this morning. I, I went to bed last night at three. I did not set an alarm. I woke up at eight. I could not go back to bed because like my brain was was nonstop thinking. Um, so in those times, I have a lot of thoughts <laughs> and I, I tend to think about right now because Twitch is so important to me, like new things and fun things that we could mm. do to um, make it interesting. And um, I ran a couple of ideas by Garcia. Like I kept trying to encourage him to be part of the stream. And yeah. uh, he 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 was a little uncertain and a little shy about the idea at first. And then I was like, um, one of the things that I, I want for Garcia in his life, he, he used to be very big into like acting and like he loves acting, he loves voice acting. Um, is to be able to pursue that more. And uh, I told him a long time ago that I think he should get into voicing audiobooks as like a as like a, a gap sort of step in that direction because there's a lot of room in audiobooks. There's a lot of people who want audiobooks and will pay and there's really easy resources to kind of get into that. Um, but we never really pursued it, you know. Uh, so mm -hmm. I was thinking on all of this one morning and then I was like, oh, we could have Garcia read short stories on stream and he would be really good at that. And then it just kind of snowballed from there for that one. It was just an idea um, because he has a wonderful voice and he deserves to use it. Oh, yeah. yeah. I, he has that like, no. soothing I don't think anybody's going to disagree with that. <laughs> I know. I need more. <laughs> I know. Need I'm like, at this point, I feel like I've I listened to the book just, just to listen. <laughs> I don't care what book. Just the most boring just book. Just, uh, dreaming. The and it's so even if it's the if, even if it's the Bible, I'll just oh, schmexy voice. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, Turbo's got it. Um, uh, um, so yeah, that yeah. Was well, good. that's um that that's the list of the main questions that we had. Um, yeah, I mean, so, there's a couple, but we we literally went over them in our tangents, so we're just kind of yeah, exactly. Them. So um. <laughs> so you know, if chat has any wonderful things that they want us to talk yeah. about, we can talk. Anyone, we do like, a little little QA, like something interesting, so, like a topic you want us to discuss with Dorcas. Yeah. Uh, um. you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Well, I'm gonna uh, see if I uh, missed while, any questions. If, well, do you have anything you want to ask us, or well, any topics you want to bring I was up? Actually, wondering if I could oh, yeah. something new really quick. Okay. Go for it. Shoot it. But I, I'm so like I said, we we have a lot of ideas. Um, mm. 
and we're going to be starting a new stream in a few weeks, a couple weeks. Um, and it's going to be Mick Kojak, myself, and uh, Garcia doing what we're calling, I think we haven't 100% nailed down the title, but we're calling Warzone Country Club, which is going to be okay. us playing Warzone um, in an improv style where we interview people <laughs> kind of like as if we're on the battlefield. Um, <laughs> <laughs> huh. Yeah, yeah, we're going to do Warzone Country Club. I'll be, I can't act for my life, so I'll be like mm. the journalist asking questions. And um, we're, we we have this idea. We don't have any idea really how it's going to go. But uh, yeah, I'd be curious how that would um, <laughs> work. Yeah. 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 Um, uh, we're going to basically be fighting people off. Um, and also, so we'll be playing Warzone. We're going to have certain rooms we hole up in. And okay. then we're going to try and hold those rooms while we do these interviews. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and see okay. how it goes. Yeah. It's, I mean, yeah. <laughs> it definitely sounds unique. Sounds yeah. like um, if you could pull it off, like it would be really fun to watch. We've got um, no idea if we can yet. So, yeah, I was like, I, I mean, it's definitely something that I feel like <laughs> just trying it is going to be fun in itself. Exactly. Yeah. Um, and if it goes horribly wrong, it's probably still funny content as well. So <laughs> that's kind of what we were like. We're gonna die a lot, and like, uh, it, I don't know if at a certain point people will try to like stream snipers, but that might be part of the fun. So <laughs> you see, that'll be my stream. Okay. Stream sniping you guys. That'll be <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's where yeah, I'll we'll stream. Just stream the whole time. Perfect. Yeah. Just I'll play in. Warzone. But I'll pick it up now. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly, if it were just us like fending off people we knew, it would be the best thing ever in my brain. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Kill Shackalaka Lane. What the fuck are you doing here? <laughs> yeah, get out of here. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Turbo oh, did we get any questions? I, I saw really, Turbo I mean, said something. Oh, did Turbo say something? He said improv, yes, improv is chaos. Uh, did we talk about singing a little bit? A little bit. Mm -hmm. You have something um, specific you want to ask about? Her singing. And then also Egyptian mythology question mark. Okay. <laughs> I, I know no you have enough. some Egyptian oh, mythology themes. Yeah. Uh, like your cat. Your, your, I thought it was a dog. dog whatever. I, I don't know. Yes, both. Both? Both? Okay. both? okay. We were both yeah. right. Good. Yeah. <laughs> you good, are... good, good, good. Yeah. Um, our dog's name, we, we call her Osi, but that's short for Osiris. Um, yeah. Our cat's name is Ia. And... Um, we decided on OC originally. She, we got her first because um, she's actually, so her breed is a Basenji Kelpie mix. Basenji is an Egyptian dog. And we were like, what's a cool like Egyptian name we could name her? She's all black. She's very regal looking. So we decided on o Osiris for her. Um, and then we decided on Ia because it's, so in Egyptian mythology, like Ia and Osiris actually get conflated. Um, in certain like writings and stuff, they're often mistaken for each other, and um, they they have a lot of similarities as far as appearance. They're both all black. They got the pointy ears, and they both have stunted tails. So we were like, mm. oh, that's perfect. <laughs> but as far as like my knowledge of Egyptian mythology, it's really lacking. <laughs> if anyone <laughs> wants, yeah, to, okay. like, to go on it. I don't really know. <laughs> I would not I be able to know. add to the conversation at all either. So it's, <laughs> it's perfectly fine. Yay! Um, <laughs> uh, um, let's right. see. Well, thanks for the uh, Turbo wants a Twitch band. A Twitch band. Yeah, we've been talking about that. When? He's on. He's on a uh, guitar. I got the keyboard. Uh, yeah. um, singer, obviously. <laughs> I will. Um, I'll just. I'll just be a background dancer. Uh, we'll give you a tambourine. I'll teach you some tambourine. Oh, yes, a tambo. <sighs> Yeah, um. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's a sore spot for me because like <laughs> backup singers always have to play the tambourine. Like people wanted me to play the tambourine, and I was mm. like, no. <laughs> I'll do the triangle instead. <laughs> there you go. The I electric triangle. <laughs> oh, um. So another Garcia for Potato How Lane. How did you all meet? Uh, it's a wait, wait, first wait, wait, of all. Wait, wait, wait. You, you, you cut out. Repeat that. Oh, did I? Okay. So um, another another Garcia asked uh for Potato and Lane. Um. Oh. How did we meet? So uh, this story goes goes pretty far back. Um, so um, Lane, I'd say uh, about how old are you? Uh, about you 19 speaking? years ago, um, I was born as Lane's cousin. Yes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and ever since, we've been stuck together. Yeah, basically. <laughs> 
That's a good story. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, no, uh, me, so. me and Lane, uh, cousins, uh, there's not a lot of fam- like, Our family's pretty small on that side. Yeah. Um, on my, uh, because uh, he's on my mom's side for me. Uh, I think the same for you. Yeah. yeah our, there's, our moms yeah. are sisters. There yes. we go. <laughs> um, I think there's so, like uh, let's see three so like seven cousins between our entire yeah family, so yeah there's not, like so, uh, so there's not a lot um, and we all lived in Colorado for years too so yeah it was, so I was like I grew up hanging out with Lane at family gatherings all the time uh, yeah. playing there's games even like and a stuff while where you guys were living with us too I think oh no you were living in our uh, mm-hmm. old house our rental property yeah when I was um when I was really young I I barely remember that house i was yeah. like four dude i was not <laughs> old <laughs> you were you were probably old enough that you remember it yeah like eight nine but i was i was i was little yeah. um so yeah and then let's see i f- i feel like well it was probably when i was in junior high we started playing a lot of games yeah more that, together because well, that, that's when i first started getting into pc gaming which you have already been into. yeah i think I think so. Like, I got into PC gaming, and I was like, "Lane, you should play CS:GO." And I was like, nah. "With me?" And he was and like, "No, a year later, no." Got his and CSGO then and now you know, both like, me and Lane together have like five thousand hours in CS:GO combined. I love uh, it. Played so much together, um, and then yeah. So all right, Charles uh, has a question for Dorcas. How did you and oh, Garcia does- meet? Ooh, ooh, spicy. <laughs> yeah, super spicy. Actually, it's kind of funny. Like, the way we initially met um, was that he was seeing somebody that was a friend of mine <laughs> at the time. Um, and he and she had broken up. And, like, I'd only, like, met him once or twice. We weren't, the, like, super close friends. We were work friends. We'd hung out, like, once or twice out of work. Um, but I, I really you know, I enjoyed her as a person, but they were dating. And um, then Garcia and her broke up and I like was still friends with her. So I heard all of her side of the story. Right. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Um, So, so, you know, for a while there, I thought Garcia was a bad person. I was like, Oh, the worst. Yeah. Yeah. Terrible. Uh, Let me just ban him real quick. (laughs) (laughs) He still is the worst. You turned him out for 8,000 seconds. Why would you do that? <laughs> Garcia, too, uh, this is a this is uh that girl getting her revenge right now in this moment yeah. uh anyway so, so um yeah anyway after go. that welcome back we, Garcia. We didn't, welcome back we didn't talk for a really long time um but nexus and spell blooper spell blooper is one of my best friends mm-hmm. uh so nexus is her husband and he and Garcia have been best friends for a really long time. They've been really close friends. And so um, they still hung out on a regular basis. And we all decided one day to do not D&D, but a similar thing called Groups, okay. <laughs> which is a tabletop RPG game. And sure. so it was me and Garcia and Nexus and Spell, Spell Blooper and one of her brothers. Um, and wait, that was also with one of uh, Nexus's brothers. Yeah. Anyway, a big group of us. Mm-hmm. And it was kind of through that, that I started to get to know Garcia as a person more. That was also during like one of my peak de- depression phases. And like one of the things I appreciated about him and he still does this is like, he's one of those people that like, no matter who you are, he comes uh, so long as he knows you, obviously yeah. he comes up to you and he hugs you and he asks how you are. And it's such a small thing, but it made such a big difference in my life at that time. Um, and then fast forward a uh, little bit later. Spell is taking, <laughs> taking uh, he's saying that he puts you guys together. A little bit, a little bit. I'm not going to lie. We were both kind of like hinting at it. We did karaoke and that's when I really started falling for him. Because guys, you don't know this, but Garcia can sing and he's oh. amazing. Um, and uh, <laughs> why is he, he, okay, next gen tales, I think we need him to sing. <laughs> can, can you make that a reward I Ooh, feel can i spend my channel points reward. community oh. channel points to get garcia to sing for us it might be easier than that or harder actually it might be harder than that but we have a plan you guys garcia i haven't said this like is a for sure thing because we haven't fully finished practicing and it depends on how quickly we go to 500 followers so if this doesn't happen i apologize at 500 followers but I am working on playing the piano for some songs and okay. we're going to do a collab where he sings on a song with me while I play the piano and it's Ooh. 
awesome. <laughs> so you will awesome. probably get to see him sing. Uh, Can't wait. Or hear him. I don't know. Quick, if everybody see. follow so we can see. Them. Go, 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 go. <laughs> no, go, go, go. <laughs> I, I don't want it to happen quickly because I'm still I working do. on the song. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, I'm, I'm halfway through being prepared for the piano part. But you know, uh, if there's more pressure, I'll just practice more. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um so yeah you might hear him sing but uh yeah spell blooper definitely and nexus definitely encouraged it i cannot deny that um and then i kept hinting to him like like after that karaoke night i kept texting him and i'd be like hey are you coming out to this event that jackie mm -hmm. oops yeah spell blooper and nexus were doing um or this one and he'd be like no i'm not he did not get that i was interested at all from these creepy <laughs> no, we, we, we classic never do. classic we never do. <laughs> classic dude <laughs> so i finally asked him out um i sent him a text because i couldn't i was gonna ask him out in person but mm -hmm. he never he was never there so then i sent him a text and yeah that's how we met <laughs> okay. can i ask how long ago that was i'm just curious uh it was four years ago four okay. years ago. okay sometimes okay. it feels like an eternity Help yeah me. <laughs> <laughs> i'm just kidding i love that yeah uh, blink twice okay. if you need help <laughs> I can't blink. Oh shit, that was a fucked up blink. There we go. Right. <laughs> it's just winking, but with both eyes. All right, it's not oh that my hard. God, so complicated. <laughs> um, so before um, Turbo uh, Slancho asked, like, how did Potato and I meet uh, Dorcas and uh, Arasia? And we uh, basically just through Breeze. About this. Yeah, we kind of talked about it. Yeah, we raided I, Breeze. I raided Breeze one night, and then Breeze uh, is like, "Oh hey, this is my basically." I don't know, like cousin or something i don't know yeah um, i missed that part i i think <laughs> i like i rated hung out for a bit i was editing so i wasn't paying a lot of attention mm -hmm. i think i missed bed and then i don't know i kind of just like woke up the next day and there was all these people here i was like okay <laughs> <laughs> i was like this is fine um <laughs> yeah i was like i was like yeah. against your will <laughs> yeah oh it's been great though so <laughs> um uh, so yeah not not a big story but it's important important yeah. time it was yeah. big time it was it basically like blew our channels over to that uh affiliate. The affiliate. yeah it was like yeah yeah because, like, because, yeah, yeah, because I, I think um i don't know if it was breeze but one of them one of you guys like was the one that like got me over um to the 50 and that was this lane hit it the same night. I think it was, was it the night that we it was breeze. It was the rated, rated breeze. Then, yeah, it was the night we rated breeze that both of us got affiliate because we finally hit the fifty followers, mm -hmm. um, which I was super we, cool. We were like, "You guys are like two away. We're gonna make sure you get yeah. this." <laughs> yeah, because uh, like we we had actually done really well where we actually had the viewer count, which I feel like most people struggle with. Yeah, um, exactly. it was just like we can't get the followers. <laughs> like, yeah, which is it's um, which like is, it's so weird to think about. Honestly. It's a weird it's a weird order to hit the milestones. Um, well, and then for Dorcas sure. was even weirder because I think hers was just hours streamed. Yeah, yeah. Who, like, what? Whose problems the hours streamed? <laughs> Excuse me. Who, what? I'm sorry. What are your secrets? It's like six hours a month. <laughs> How did you I not just, hit that? I just, I really didn't think it was gonna happen so fast. So I was like, I'll hit that eventually. Uh, uh, no, I didn't. Uh, I, I just remember. I think that was the most ridiculous thing. <laughs> yeah, I was like, guys, I just need to stream more, and we'll be good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's see. I don't think I saw any more questions. I gotta scroll through. Um, I did uh, wanna mostly spell blooper saying that she set you guys up. Okay, yeah. okay. Um, so Garcia, I don't think we'll actually be on camera for the 500 followers. Mm -hmm. So don't. I, I, mean, I saw that... Turbo say that, and I was like, "Don't get too excited." I, I don't know how. Yeah, because gonna... I know he doesn't want his like face to be on, and that's fine. Yeah. I understand that. He's a shy boy. I, I, so... I still want to hear his. his uh, Singing just, voice. Just have him in like a hoodie and just like tight shut <laughs> and like talk to him. Or him. print out of like a picture of like you know your face and like basically like, stick it over his face. And, oh like, yeah, 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 yeah. You can get the mask. That's a great idea. And I it's love just, it. It's just, it's <laughs> Dorcas Sorceress too. <laughs> You're seeing duplicate. <laughs> uh, and taking her testosterone. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> Uh, I see that Charles Buco has a silly question about if Garcia really eats his treats, and the answer is yes every time. Oh, good. I don't know. Uh, I think he also asked if anybody had a favorite bird because he, 
I can tell you he picked up bird watching, so he's like super oh. this right now. Um, don't. I don't, I don't have one. I'm disappointing. I'm sorry, but I don't know <laughs> many birds, but I do yeah. know that when a blue jay like flies by, I get excited. That's about it. There you go. Boom. There There's you go, your answer. Jay. You're welcome. Uh, <laughs> favorite burb, blue jay. All the birds. Um, burb. <laughs> <laughs> um, lots of people are also um, contributing to your Aya yeah, stream. Yeah, I'll say. I don't know. If, <laughs> I don't know if you noticed that, but it's gone up a lot. I know. Today. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I saw that. Um, yeah. So basically, anyone who doesn't know, like, there's like this 10 hour um, Aya Ya song, which is I don't remember who found it. I think it was I, I heard from Breeze. <laughs> I store kissed. Thank you. <laughs> nice. um, but eventually, if I meet that goal, I'm gonna basically sit on stream, watch the entire. There's the other one. <laughs> the poster. <laughs> Uh, oh, no. And then watch the ah! entire ten-hour video, and just sit there and watch that and stream that. So that just sounds horrible. It, it sounds be like horrible. Torture. Okay, but because like, hear me out. It's not going to end at ten hours. You're going to no. leave, and it's not going to stop. It's all you're going to hear for weeks. Yep. <laughs> you're going to have to like immediately yourself. start blaring anything else. <laughs> um, I, don't know, I think it's going to be great content. I'm also going to record it and throw it on our YouTube. <laughs> why not? <laughs> You're gonna throw oh the God. whole ten hour chunk. The whole YouTube. ten hour or gonna, chunk. Or are you actually gonna edit it down? No, it's just gonna be. The you can do hour both. Chunk. You can do both. I, could, I think the highlights. If, if there's if there's highlights, if there's like actually yeah. interesting, if it's <laughs> really just you being <laughs> for ten hours, no, don't. Post I mean, that. okay, there might be highlights for the first hour. The last <laughs> nine, I'll just be like. Oh. Just, like, have some like prepared prompts of things to talk about throughout the night. Yeah, just, you're not. Like, nah. No, 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 it's no, just uh, no. I'm just gonna go in and watch it. <laughs> <laughs> He's just like, no, I want this to be proper torture. Oh, yeah, like, yeah. I'm, I'm yeah, still yeah, iffy yeah, on yeah. if I'm oh, gonna yeah, yeah. like if I'm gonna have like chat pulled up. Like, I'm still like, should I have chat pulled up or should I just sit there in silence alone for the ten hours? I think you would actually lose your mind. <laughs> Like <laughs> legitimately, you, you know, you could do yourself like you could do something cool, like just pull up editing and edit during it at least. Do something, yeah, productive. something. <laughs> I don't know. It's uh, I still have to figure out what exactly I'm going to do for it. But I mean, you know, chat I, might be there too. And it's it's going to be, be a great stream. <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah, quality content. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I do feel like um, you know, when chat's there, it, it'll be it's yeah. it'll be fine. You'll have someone. To I mean, I'll just be like this with Aya in the background. Just <laughs> that's all it would be. Yeah. Um, Bree says no chat pause during breaks. Eating. Oh, that's the thing. I'm not gonna have like any breaks. I'm gonna maybe pee breaks, but like I'm gonna have like my uh, <laughs> sister take my dogs so around to watch one. them. Lane uh, Lane isn't allowed to poop. During no, this no, whole no go. I'll uh, I'll grab a bucket. Admitted. I'll have a bucket. <laughs> grab a bucket. Oh god, I I think there's a TOS possibly <laughs> being broken in there. No, see, um, see, no, no, I'll, I'll, I'll just I'll just go over here. I'll just go over here. Oh, oh yeah, but then 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 I I will I will immediately no, accuse you of on. not watching it. Yeah. And I'm gonna request that you redo it. Okay, no, okay. I'll, I'll be talking the whole time though. <laughs> redo the the battle. It's pre-recorded. Obviously, it's faked. <laughs> This is fake pre-recorded content. Just do that? Is that Damn, something people can do? I don't do know. <laughs> that is just... Right. Uh, no, I'm good. I'll pa I don't have that much time on my hand. I can't. I don't have time to do that. So uh, I kind of need to go kind of soon. I have a girl coming over. Oh, sure. Oh, so, ooh. Well, Lane. <laughs> um, so I, I know like we are like... We always the uh, interviewee is always the one that has to leave, but now it's me. So it's Lane, or it's me. Yeah. Usually it's yeah. me, actually. Me or the interviewer. Um, You're just so... saying that because Turbo had to leave. <laughs> yeah, Turbo had to leave. Yeah. I didn't uh, know how long we were here for, so I got all night. So you know, uh, everyone, thank you for watching this uh, stream or video on YouTube. Uh, follow Dorcas Sorceress if you haven't already. I assume everyone in chat has, and our YouTube probably already follows you. But if you haven't, go give her a follow. She's an awesome girl. She does some sick. Uh oh, know, mom's in the things. chat. Mom's in the chat. Mom's oh, in the no. chat talking about your uh, your girl girl coming oh, over. I, uh, no, I oh, about he's no. been exposed. Oh, I've been exposed. <laughs> <laughs> Hot diggity. Oh well, that's awkward. Um, end the stream. Everyone want to drop. Quick, this remove the remove the pod. <laughs> remove the pod. Uh, uh, and so sorry. Anyway, thank you for everyone for watching the uh, video. If you liked it. <laughs> 
If you're on YouTube, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. It really helps with the algorithm. Subscribe to WSD for uh, more streamer stories and the uh, game shows we're going to be doing. Game shows. Um, game shows. Uh, those will be on the WASD Express Twitch channel, too. So red. <laughs> um, you know, it's still like probably a couple weeks out at least. We got some, got to work on basically all the animations, but, you know, it'll be there. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Yorkus, is there anything else you want to say? Uh, Feel free to plug yourself or something, oh, whatever. Yeah. Uh, I think I plugged myself with the one thing. Um, let's see what else. Anything else? Anything else? Oh, yeah. And the piano. I already mentioned everything. The piano reward at 500 followers. I'll be playing piano. Garcia hopefully will be singing with me. And Warzone Country Club. And also, uh, I love you guys. <laughs> oh, oh, love you too, buddy. I say buddy to everybody. I'm sorry. No, I say hey, buddy I... a lot. <laughs> It's a habit. Uh, it's a habit. I'm sorry. It's okay. No, no I'm just. <laughs> I was um, just losing my mind. Bye. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs>